Hi everyone and welcome to Toddler Storytime. My name is Miss Maria and this is Elizabeth and she'll be helping out with the motions for some of our songs today. All right, let's go ahead and get started with our opening song. Ready? Hands go up and hands go down. I can turn myself around. I can stand up on one shoe. I can listen, so can you. I can sit, I'll show you how. Story time is starting now. All right, excellent job. So Elizabeth, what is it that we are talking about today? What are we reading about? Pets, animals. Okay, so Elizabeth says we are reading about pets and animals today. So raise your hand if you have any pets at home. Very cool. So we do too, actually. She's new to our house, but I'll just get her real quick. Hey. Good morning. So this, this is one of our pets. Her name is Pepper. Right, so today when we talk about pets, we're gonna talk about things we have in common with them and ways to take care of them, right? But we're gonna let Pepper sleep. There you go. All right, so our first book is called Looking Good with the words by Allie Busby and read with the permission of Child's Play International. Right. Elephant has floppy ears. Can you all point to your ears? Pull on your ear. So do I. We also have floppy ears. Maybe not as floppy as an elephant, but. Bush babies have the big eyes. Can you point to your eyes and make them wide? So do I. We have big eyes too. Fox has a pointy Nose. Do you have a nose? Can you point to it? So do I. We have noses too. Crocodile has sharp teeth. Wow, look at those teeth. Can you all grin and show all your teeth? Show your teeth. <laughs> So do I. We have sharp, pointy teeth too, huh? Maybe not as sharp as a crocodile, but still. Lizard has 10 little fingers and toes. Can you all wiggle your fingers for me? So do I. So we have fingers like a lizard, huh? Okay, let's go ahead and do our first song. Let's see, let's do Roly Poly. We haven't done that one in a while, huh? All right, are you ready? Roly Poly, Roly Poly, up, 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 up. Roly Roly Poly, Roly Roly Poly, down, 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 down. Roly poly, roly poly, fast, 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 fast. Roly, roly poly, roly, roly poly, slow, 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 slow. Good job, awesome job. All right, our next book about the animals is called Hello Love, written by Taro Mura and read with the permission of Chronicle Books. Fish swim, hello. But they kind of look like they're upside down, huh? So how do fish say hello? By touching noses. They touch their noses together to say hello. Ducks quack, hi. Can you all give a quack for me? Quack, 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 quack. Right? Is that what ducks sound like? How do ducks say hi? <gasps> By touching beaks. They touch their beaks together. Elephants say 
Greetings. How would an elephant say hello, do you think? Hmm. Maybe with their trunks? Let's see. Maybe they say hello with their trunks. <gasps> yeah, by shaking trunks. So they use their trunks to shake like we shake hands. Monkeys hoot. Hooray! Can you all make a monkey sound for me? And what do monkeys do? Is that what a monkey sounds like? But they hold hands when they say hello by holding hands. Mommy says, I love you. By cuddling with me. And daddy does too. So just like animals say hello and show the, each other they love each other, humans do too with cuddles and hugs and kisses, right? So that's the end of that one. All right, so let's do a new song, right? So this song is called Hello Kitty Cat. Um, and it is sung to the tune of I'm a Little Teapot. So I'm a Little Kitty Cat. All right, ready? I'm a little kitty cat, nice and sweet. Here are my whiskers and here are my feet. When I go out hunting, mice beware, or you might just have a scare. <gasps> oh no, let's do it one more time, all right? So when we're going out hunting as the cat, make sure you do it quietly and slowly so the mice don't hear, ready? I'm a little kitty cat, nice and sweet. Here are my whiskers, here are my feet. When I go out hunting, mice beware, or you might just have a scare. <gasps> oh, whew, I think the mouse got away though, we're okay. All right, let's go ahead and read our last book for today. It is called Pets with the words by Jill McDonald and read with the permission of Random House Children's Books. Scaly, fluffy, furry, or feathered. Pets come in many shapes and sizes. They all need special care and love. Always be gentle and calm with pets. Animals can easily get scared or hurt. Hmm. Let's see what kind of pets these kids have, huh? How about over here? Can you guys see what pet does she have? A lizard, huh? She has a lizard. How about this one here? It has long ears and can wiggle its nose. What animal does that? A rabbit, right? A rabbit. And how about this one here? It goes meow, meow. A cat, a kitty cat, right? And how about this little green animal here? And it goes, it hops. What animal is small and green and hops? And it goes ribbit, 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 ribbit. A frog, right? A frog. And what about this animal right here? It's big, it has four legs, and it goes neigh. What animal does that? A horse, right? A horse. Uh-oh, there we go. Thump, thump. Can you all thump, thump your feet? Ready? Like a rabbit, thump, thump. Rabbits have long floppy ears, whiskers, and a nose they can twitch. Can you twitch your nose? I can't twitch my nose very well. But <laughs> can you twitch your nose like a rabbit? <laughs> Rabbits eat hay, fruits, and vegetables. Meow! Cats have whiskers too. They like to sleep and Stretch. Can you all stretch like a, a cat? Ready? 
stretch and go meow. Oh, good stretch like a cat. Cats clean themselves with their tongues like this. Like a cat. It has small hooks and it feels rough like sandpaper. Ribbit. Frogs love water and land. A pet frog lives in a big tank with places to swim, hop, and sleep. Can you all hop like a frog? Ready? On the count of three, we'll all hop like frogs. One, two, three. Hop! Hop like a frog. Frogs eat insects. Ugh. They have a long, sticky tongue to help them catch food, like flies, huh? <gasps> woof, woof, woof. Dogs are playful and can be big or small, just like Pepper, right? She's still small, but she might get bigger later. Some dogs can be trained to do tricks. Can you bark like a dog? Everyone bark like a dog, ready? Woof, 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 woof. Dogs should be walked every day. They have lots of energy and exercise makes them feel better. Nay! Horses are big, beautiful animals that can take people for rides on their backs. Wow. A female horse is called a mare. A male horse. Male horse is called a stallion. Can you gallop like a horse? What sound do horses make when they gallop? Maybe they go clip clop clip clop. Okay, so we're gonna gallop like a horse. Ready? Like we're riding a horse. Clip clop clip clip clop clip. clip. <laughs> march 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 march. Ants are busy builders. Can you trace your finger along the maze of tunnels? Let's see. Up here, there's an A, an N, a T, and an S. That spells ants. Ants are insects. Their body is divided into three parts. A head, you have a head, right? Just like an ant. A thorax, which thorax is like the middle, like your belly and an abdomen, which is like your bum. This spunky little hamster is running on a wheel. Do hamsters make any noise? No, I've never heard a hamster make a noise. They just wiggle their noses like a rabbit hmm? and then run on their wheel. Did you know they can store food in their cheeks to eat later? Can you pop your cheeks out like a hamster? All right, on the count of three, ready? One, two, three. <gasps> so that's what hamsters look like when they put food in their cheeks to save for later. Hamsters like soft wood chips on the bottom of their cage so they can dig and make a nest. Splish, splash. Fish have scales, fins, and gills to breathe underwater. They need space to wiggle and swim. What colors do you see in these fish? Hmm? Oh, there's some pink and orange. What color is this fish? Green. And this little one is yellow. Lizards use their tongues to smell. Wow. They poke it in and out to taste the air. Can you stick your tongue out like a lizard? So stick your tongue in and out like you're tasting the air. Ready? Mm -hmm. <laughs> That's what lizards do. Lizards are reptiles. They are cold blooded and have dry scales. Just like you, sometimes your pet needs to visit the doctor. Veterinarians are doctors for animals. How cool. Veterinarians look after all kinds of animals, from small mice to big elephants. Ooh, wow. Would your family like a pet? 
Visit your local shelter or animal rescue to find the best pet for you to love. So that could be a horse, maybe not a horse. I don't know if your parents want you to have such a big animal, but it could be a kitten or an ant farm or a dog or a frog or a lizard. Right? And that's the end. Awesome. Let's go ahead and do our closing song, which has animals in it too, right? Ready? See you later. Alligator in a wild crocodile. Give a hug, ladybug. Blow a kiss, jellyfish. See you soon, big baboon. Out the door, dinosaur. Take care, polar bear. Wave goodbye, butterfly. All right, thank you for joining us. We'll see you next time. Bye.